Let's begin with new vector. Name of this vector is mosquito. And in this part, I would like to discuss differentiation between anophelins and culicins. There are two main tribes of mosquitoes, tribe anophelini and tribe culicini. Tribe anophelini includes only one genus called as anophilis. Tribe culicini includes three genera culex, edis and mansonia. These four genera are related to disease transmission in India. In this slide you can see image of anophilis mosquito and image of edis mosquito. Here you can see image of Culex mosquito and image of Mansonia mosquito. Let's see general description of mosquito. Body of mosquito consists of three parts, head, thorax and abdomen. Head of mosquito shows presence of eyes, proboscis and antennae or feelers. Mosquito shows presence of a pair of large compound eyes. Proboscis is long needle-like structure. There is one pair of antennae on the head. These antennae are bushy in male mosquitoes and they are not bushy in female mosquitoes. This helps to differentiate between males and females. Thorax of mosquito is large, it is rounded and it shows presence of a pair of wings. Wings are present on dorsal side and beating of the wings produces buzzing noise. When the mosquito is at rest, wings are folded. On ventral side of thorax, three pairs of legs are present. Abdomen of mosquito has 10 segments and last two segments are modified to form external genitalia. Life history of mosquito includes four stages, egg, larva, pupa and adult. Let's see the differences related to these stages between the two tribes that is Anophilini and Culicini. Eggs are laid down singly by Anophilini mosquitoes and eggs are laid down in clusters or rafts by Culicini mosquitoes. Each raft may contain 100 eggs to 250 eggs. Only exception for this is Edis. Eggs of Anophilini mosquitoes are boat shaped and eggs of Culicini mosquitoes are oval shaped. Eggs of Anophilini mosquito possess lateral floats. Such lateral floats are not seen in Culicini mosquitoes. In this image you can see eggs of Anophilini mosquito. You can note presence of lateral floats. Lateral floats are absent in Culicini mosquito. You can even observe single eggs laid down by Edis and a raft of Culex mosquito. Larvae of Anophilini mosquitoes rests parallel to the water surface. Siphon tube is absent and abdominal segment of these larvae shows presence of palmate hairs. Larvae of Culicini mosquito are suspended in the water with the head downwards at an angle to the water surface. Siphon tube is present but palmate hairs are absent. In this image you can note larva of Anophilini mosquito resting parallel to the water surface whereas larva of Culicini mosquito 
it is suspended with head downward even you can note presence of siphon tube in culicini larva pupal stage of anopheleni mosquito shows broad and short siphon tube whereas pupal stage of culicini mosquito shows long and narrow siphon tube and you can see it in image when at rest adult anopheleni mosquito is inclined at an angle to the surface at rest body of adult culicini mosquito shows presence of hunch back position adult anopheleni mosquito has spotted wings whereas adult culicini mosquito do not have spotted wings both sexes of adult anopheleni mosquitoes shows long palpi but in case of adult culicini female mosquito palpi are short in this slide you can see resting position of anopheleni and culicins please note anopheleni are showing inclined position whereas culicins they are showing hunch back position